Good morning and welcome. Uh, this morning we're going to be talking about the best way to start and finish your day. You know, during days of uncertainty and days of unrest, it's important to start your day by refueling your soul. Your soul, well really your soul is the way you think, the way you feel, the way you choose. Just like your physical body, it has to be fed every day to stay healthy as well. If you're not feeding your soul, you're going to be drained emotionally and spiritually. So how do we do that? How do you refuel your soul? Well, you do that by getting into God's word every day. Jesus said, man shall not live by bread alone, but on every word that comes from the mouth of God. The Bible is life. You don't just read it when you have a problem. You don't just read it when you need advice. You don't open it up just when you need a, a pick-me-up. You feed on it every day so that you are consistently nourished and growing in truth and love. Don't begin the day by scrolling through your phone. Don't begin the day by listening to the news. I'll tell you, it's some pretty bad news on the radio right now. Don't let the last thing that fills your mind every day be something from the television. None of those things are going to feed your soul. If you only develop one habit during this pandemic that has been going on for two years, let it be that you're starting and ending your day with the Word of God. It doesn't matter how long you read. It matters how you let God's Word change you. How you see yourself and others in light in the light of God's love. It matters how you view your circumstances and how your relationship with God deepens and grows on a daily basis. Isaiah chapter 50 verse 4 says, The sovereign Lord has given me his words of wisdom so that I may know how to comfort the weary. Morning by morning, he awakens me and opens my understanding to his will. Are you weary? Are you worn down and worn out? Nourish your soul. Stay emotionally healthy by starting and ending every day with the word of God. God bless and have a wonderful day today. Let's continue to exchange prayers daily.